Hello, good day. I'm Oliver from Token Hobby. Let's see how to set up the mix control to start pump for this K988 loader from Coupled. So let's first go to the radio basic. Let's see the setting of the pump. Channel road. Pump it is channel 5. Click channel 5. So now up end it is 25%. Up range 50%, that means the maximum 50% from right side for the pump to start. But as you see the pump stop at the left side 100%, so negative 100%. So let's start to see. So coming to right side 25%. So means this pump start if 100 load, it is from negative 100% to positive 100%, that is 100% load. So now this pump 100 plus 25 that's 125 but other side for right side still have 75 left so means the pump load now it is uh, so around 125 to 200 so it is around 62.5% that's the pump load. So we set up 50% for the right side for the maximum. So when we mix control, the, let's see. So when, if I mix only start one motion, it's only working 50% for the pump. But if I start two motion, it will be overlap for the mix control. It will start as around 62% of the pump. But if I run in three motion, it has reached the top point around 150 to 200%. That means around 75%. So that's the setup meaning. So better setup like this, 25%, 50%. Okay, let's put down, let's see the setting. Already now it is with the mix control. Move back, I touch it. So go back. Let's go to the model pro mix. And then, so mix number one, mix one, two, three, that's original setting for mix control for the hydraulic sound. So, uh, so let's see, bucket to channel 16, channel 16 is hydraulic sound. That's the control curve. And uh, it is always on, no switch control, always setting the mix control on. So big arm with the hydraulic sound. Mix number three, that's the steering for the hydraulic sound. Okay. So let's see for the settings from mix number four, that's setting for start hydraulic by the mix control to start the pump. So mix number four, that's J1 to the channel five, hydraulic pump, master J1, slab CH5, mix red, it's setting like this. So the pump stop at the negative side. So we have to start the pump, negative to negative will become positive. So setting all negative side, this point. You set up like this, you choose the, the blue point, move it, move it, and you rising or lowering to change, same like this will be the same setting, you can start the pump. So, and come out, mix number four, for switch it on. So, only click these two points, yeah. Now it is switched off. Should be, no, still not, still on. Let's try again. Okay, so for our setting of the mix control to start the pump, we start from mix number four, five, six, seven. So, see again, mix number four, it is J1, the bucket to start the pump. That's the control curve. Mix number five, it is J2, 
That's the arm lifting up and down, slap the hydraulic pump. Same, all this control curve, same. So another one, it is J4 steering to start the pump. Control curve, same. And uh, mix number seven, it is auxiliary six means the return to middle check it out so automatic middle to middle position switch SWH okay so that means auxiliary six means SWH controlling automatically return to middle position so slave the hydraulic pump to start Control curve, it is different for this one because uh, if you not putting all this, this line flat to 0%, it will, because uh, positive and negative will neutralize the control curve to start the pump. So set up like this, you will have the pump start for middle Return to middle automatically. Let's one more mix control to start the pump for automatically return to middle position. Control curve different. So all of this is the same. So totally seven mix control. So for the quick connection, I will not set up. You can start the pump and uh, disconnect start it's easy so no need set up all this switch no switch control always on the mix control seven mix control always on others are off so that's all the mix control to start the pump for this one let's run it a little bit start the sound on steering so you will see for mix control, there is a little bit delay because the ESC getting signal slower. But if you want to operate it more quickly, you can start the pump directly. So start the pump directly, you will have more quick reaction. Thank you, that's the mix control for this K988 loader, right?